one of the things that I thought about when I was preparing to talk to you folks about how transformative college can be. Um, like you heard, I actually graduated from uh, Holy Cross College in Worcester. And I remember early on when I showed up at Holy Cross and I studied, started studying there was, I started to look around and, and see the opportunity that was there and say, wow, something, something just happened in my life. Like, why am I here? It seems like something has dramatically changed. You know, my dad worked in a, a local market, a corner market. I worked in a local corner market forever, it seems. Um, but somehow, when I was at Holy Cross, I got the feeling that there was a lot of great opportunity there. We had, you know, the, the head of Coca-Cola was on the board of directors. You know, there were high um, people in high areas from all around the country. The alumni had a great alumni work network. That's where I started to realize that college is able to transform my life. And one of my messages to you is that college will be able to transform your lives in ways that, that you can't imagine. One of the things that happened to me is because I went to Holy Cross, I went to law school. After law school, I began, began a practice in corporate law, which may not sound exciting to many of you, but it actually pays really, really well. Um, I think one of the things, and one of the things I have in my notes here is that probably you've already heard that if you get a bachelor's degree over your lifetime, you're going to make a million dollars more than someone who hasn't. And some of you folks like Emmanuel who actually chose a degree like engineering or electrical engineering or people that get advanced degrees that number rises actually much higher. The other point to think of is that not only does a bachelor's degree bring you more money, it keeps you more employed. We have unemployment rates now, of, I think it's probably dropped down, it's probably around six or seven percent here in Massachusetts. If you have a bachelor's degree, your unemployment rate is around two percent. So that a lot of the folks that are unemployed are folks that weren't able to get a bachelor's degree. The other piece that happens with this is since I was able to get an education, go to law school, get a good job, my kids were also able to do that. I was able to give opportunity to my kids. So I have a daughter who's now a lawyer herself, makes a great living, has a great life. She's actually a trial attorney. She has opportunities and choices available to her that my grandmother who made the rubber gloves could never dream of. And that's because she had the opportunity to get a great education, and she had that opportunity because I was able to get a great education. One of the things for you folks in this room, you know, we talked about your ability to make more than a million dollars if you didn't graduate from college. But one of the things that I hear as chairman of the of um, the Committee on Higher Education is I started to hear this phrase that was, I'm the first generation out of poverty. I, I never heard that phrase before. I'm the first generation out of poverty. And they attribute that to their college education. So what happens with these kids is that they're now able to have great jobs, live in great neighborhoods, make a lot of money, have great comfortable lives. But it doesn't stop there. It carries on to their children. That their children now have great lives and live in great neighborhoods and are able to make a lot of money. So not only is the work that you're doing now or you start to do now, entering college, changing your life and transforming your life, potentially what you're doing here today and when you go to college, you're going to transform your family's lives forever. The generations that follow you are going to be much better off and have much more opportunity than you folks were given. But they're going to get that opportunity because you took this opportunity to seize the, what was in front of you and to seize the education to get what you need to get ahead. 